Alright folks, how you doing? Bob and Joe here. I'm on my 30 minute break. I got about six minutes left, so this will be a short video. <coughs> I had someone make a comment the other day. Uh, I ain't sure if they were joking or what. They made the comment on the trailer swing. And they was talking about their tracking. Look, folks, your tra trailer swing is a matter of when you're pulling out of someplace or backing in, but most commonly it's when you're pulling out when it gets anybody. That's how far your trailer, the very back end of your trailer swings when you're pulling out. A lot of damage is done by that because people will cut it too short. They don't realize and they done tag somebody with their trailer swing. The uh, farther forward you have your trailer tandem, the more trailer swing you have. The farther back you have them, the less. Of course, if you take, if you got them farther back, you need to take a wider swing on pulling out. He was talking about his trailer not going straight uh, behind the road down. Uh, down the road behind his truck. That's tracking. Trailer tracking. Uh, normally what the cause of that is is your alignment on your trailer. Uh, somehow the axles have twisted just a little bit. One side a little bit farther forward than the other one. That's what causes that tracking for it to go dog leg and you hear some calling it. That is uh, actually a pretty simple repair if your company will pay to have it done. Now he was talking about it, did it on every load, every trailer that he pulled, the trailer was off. What that sounds like is he needs a three axle alignment on his tractor. Same thing can happen to your drive back here is if something will get a little loose, something will happen they get twisted just a little bit if you're uh, if it's a situation like he's talking about where every trailer he put picks up he can't just look down it straight down the sides of it if that's happening on every trailer chances are it's his tractor needs a three axle alignment uh, it's really that simple it's also something that most companies, especially the bigger the company, the worse they want to pay to have it done. It's not that expensive, a couple hundred dollars. It ain't a big deal. If nothing's broken, all they got to do is loosen it up, adjust it, tighten it back down. Most companies don't want to spend the money. That's what's happening with your truck, driver. So there you go. Three and a half minutes, and I done explained it to you. Y'all remember, God loves you, so do I. I gotta go trucking. Y'all have a blessed day now. Bye.